Hey there everyone, I'm Yuno Stern from Gizmo Brief. Today in this video I'm going to be unboxing a product released this week that's half old, half new. What is it? Surface Book with Performance Space. Let's take a look. Well, let's get into it. First you have to take off the tape right on the side of the box. Once this is taken off, you can lift up the flap and be greeted with the Surface Book. Next, you pull up the flap and there is the Surface Book with Performance Base attached to the tablet portion. Next is the Surface Pen. Comes included right with the Surface Book and a AAA battery with it. And then here is where you have the literature. Inside the Microsoft Surface Book, little quick start guide, and also more information in there. Off to this side, we can see that there's another box that we can take out. In this box, you can see that there is the power cord and also the power brick to charge up the device. The Surface Book is most definitely a beautiful piece of technology. It is uh, made in just so such a almost a MacBook fashion, which makes it have that uh, sense of elegance and um, just simplicity that I, I really enjoy. I'm coming from a MacBook Air, which is a very elegant device and it, it does work very well for my needs. Now that the MacBook Pro has been announced and it has its meager ports, I decided that maybe it was time for something new. On the left side of the device, you can see there is a small space where the hinge is. That's normal. Then you have two USB ports and an SD card slot. Two things that the MacBook Pro does not support natively. On the right side of the device, we see Microsoft's proprietary Surface Charger port along with a mini display port. Hey, look at this. A headphone jack. Focusing on the back of the Surface Book, you can see there's the Microsoft logo along with a nice camera right on the back for usage with the tablet, which is not always recommended. It's now time to lift it up for the first time. Let's see if I can do it with one finger. Not so much. So this is the Surface Book. Trackpad immediately seems very nice. Not only that, you could also use the touchscreen. Once again, very, very nice to use. You might be wondering, does it really bounce around if you just press on the screen using it nicely? Not hard at all. Yes, it does. Is it an issue? Not too much. Do you have any questions about the service book? What's the difference between this one and the last one? Can it game? How is it just in tablet mode? If you have any questions at all, leave it in the comment section below. Do you enjoy this video? Press the like button and consider subscribing. That's all for now. I'm Yuno Stern from Gizmo Brief, and thank you for watching.